All right, guys, this is your girl, Chef Rero, straight from the N.O., you heard me. Okay, guys, today I am going to be cooking up for you guys our delicious banana nut waffle. It is a wheat banana nut waffle, and I'm also going to be fixing some strips, some grilled uh, chicken breast strips for you guys that I'm going to marinate and saute in the pan over there. Instead of using a lot of butter and using vegetable oil, I'm actually going to use coconut oil. Yes, you can use coconut oil for other things other than just your skin. And for your hair, you can use it for cooking. And the good thing about coconut oil is you don't have to use much of it. You can just use like a dime size and it'll yield the same amount as using, say, like two uh, tablespoons of butter. A benefit of using um, coconut oil, it lowers bad cholesterol. It also means that it equals a healthy part. Anything that equals healthy, it's for me. Um, the chicken, the way that I'm going to prepare, I'm going to start with a fresh chicken breast. Uh, I try to buy local owl chicken. And I go up in there and pick it out myself. It look good. I give it a little smack. You know, just a little something extra. Um, far as the wheat waffle, I'm going to be making that for you guys from scratch. Um, if you don't like banana, you do not have to make a banana nut waffle. You can make a strawberry nut waffle. You can make a pineapple nut waffle. You can make a chocolate chip waffle. There is so many options, but we're eating healthy. So no chocolate chip right now, unless you use dark chocolate, because dark chocolate, it's, it's not as sweet as using um, you know, regular milk chocolate. So if you do have that, I'm not saying you have to just give up on anything that has a little fat with it, but you can find alternatives. There, there's a bunch of them out there. We just have to sort it out. Well, a little bit about me. I did not start off as this fabulous chef that you see now. I actually started off in a recording studio with Desharae, but now I have traded in the mic and my knife is my new mic. And I am cutting it up in the kitchen instead of cutting it up on stage. I still have it in me, still could cut it up on the stage, but my passion now is cooking. All right, guys, about two years ago, I was diagnosed with H. pylori, and if you don't know what that is, it's a bacterial infection that eats up the lining of your stomach. So once I found out that I had H. pylori, my doctor gave me a list of things that I could eat and things that I couldn't eat. One of the things that I couldn't eat was sugar. I was like, how am I going to survive without eating sugar? Who doesn't like sugar? So I had to do some research because I knew that there was no way I was going to be able to not eat sugar. So I did some research and I was able to find stevia. So now stevia is a natural, um, zero calories uh, sugar that comes from a plant. It is shown to lower your blood pressure. Also another alternative that I did was I love mayonnaise and mayonnaise is really high in saturated fats, the bad ones and also cholesterol. cholesterol. So what I did was um, I came up with a substitute for mayonnaise. You can use an avocado half with uh, one fourth of skin milk and a little bit like uh, like a tablespoon of lemon juice. Now the avocado will give you the consistency of mayonnaise and the, um, the milk mixed with the milk and the lemon juice will give you a great taste. The lemon juice have a sort of a um, salty taste to it so that'll give you all the seasonings, uh, the uh, flavor that you need with it. All right guys, so I wanna take this time to welcome all of you to my mama's house of cornbread chicken and waffles. Just because we have the best fried chicken to the bone, best waffles and cornbread, doesn't mean that we don't have any healthy options for you guys. I just introduced you to our wheat banana nut waffle, also with our grilled chicken breast. And I want you to know that we have a wide range of other items on our menu that you guys can come and try out. We have grilled fish, grilled shrimp, grilled chicken. We also have sauteed green beans. We have herb rice. You name it, we probably have it. We make great salads. Everything is healthy. Come on down to my mama's house. Come see your girl, Chef Rero. Kick it up, cook it up in the kitchen with me and check out our great food, healthy choices that we have for you guys. Peace in the mouth.